Okay, friends, hello again. Today we have a card reading for Wednesday, the 30th of December, 2015. Wait, no, I'm wrong. Yes, no, I am. What day is it? Yes, it is the 30th, and tomorrow will be New Year's Eve already, and then Friday will be New Year's Day. Where is all the time flying? Well, I was pretty excited about the last message because I was feeling a very heavy, serious energy. And then the message was to really take this week seriously. So I hope that you've been having a productive uh, Monday and Tuesday. So for today, Wednesday, the 30th of December, 2015, I just wanted to point out that 30 is a three and three is the number of creation. And it's also the number of expression and expressing yourself through creativity. And we do have moon in Virgo, which is a very productive and detail oriented sign. It's also the sign of service. Um, so, you know, really tap into that number three. Three is the magic number, the number of creation and expression. and expressing through service and serving through service and finding your expression um what's the thing i'm trying to say the message that they're giving me is finding finding your expression um you know the thing i was talking about during the christmas time was loving your fellow man that's what they're trying to get me to convey to you is Love your fellow man and, oh, be your brother's keeper. That's what they're saying. So through service, you know, express yourself, express your love for your fellow man through service. Be your brother's keeper today if you can. And if you're having, you know, a short work week, really make the effort to do everything you can before you're off on Thursday and Friday. Today is a really, really great day to make an effort. And if you do make an effort today, they're telling me it's really gonna pay off and that payoff is gonna ripple out and continue into the, the 2016, um, not just for January, but it's gonna continue to kind of repeat and return to you and repeat and return to you. Um, like I'm seeing like sonar, like a bat, you know, or like a dolphin uses sonar and it bounces and it bounces back and it sends out sonar waves and bounces back and gives you feedback. Um, I see like whatever service and whatever you give out today will continue to ripple out and come back to you at different times during the year of 2016. So make the effort today. Um, I'm just being guided today to pick uh, one card. So we're going to pick one uh, Archangel Power Tarot card and then we will pick one Archangel Michael card. Um, because today, you know, the message is pretty clear already. Like they're just really in my ear buzzing about this being of service thing and really take it seriously and make the effort this week. Um, especially for the, um, uh, moon and Virgo energy. And I believe moon and Virgo energy here. I'll shuffle the cards on camera. The moon in Virgo energy goes um, for the next couple of days. Like it's Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. And the moon doesn't change until like Friday. So really, really pay attention. Uh, get some things done. And uh, enjoy being a service. It's helpful for other folks, but it's healing for you. And so the card that wants to come out, just kind of popped right out, is the Four of Gabriel. Time for a celebration, abundant rewards for hard work. Release yourself from burdensome situations. And um, the four is a number of stability. So we have a creation energy and a stability energy and creating a stable environment. And it's like a doorway and it's like a, a happy home or a good relationship, the Four of Gabriel would be the Four of Wands. This is a very, very, very happy card. It's very good energy. It's passionate, it's creative. It's using your creativity to create. What I'm hearing is you're gonna create relationships today that will 
continue to ripple out throughout 2016. You're going to accomplish something today that really matters and create um, stability foundations through relationship. So keep that in mind and um, celebrate. I feel like a lot of people are going to have Thursday and Friday off to celebrate the new year and you're gonna have a short week. So really put forth the effort um, to communicate and connect, um, to use your creativity, to express yourself, to use your creativity to build something today or um, sort of finalize, finish up the little details on a project that's almost finished. Make the effort to get it finished this week. And um, like I keep saying, it's gonna be really, it's gonna be really awesome for the new year. So let's see what Archangel Michael wants us to know about um, this, you know, making the effort and creating the relationships and, okay, well, this is interesting. Spend more time, spend more time outdoors. And the prayer is, thank you for motivating me to spend more time outdoors and for helping me relax and connecting with nature. So, you know, this is a beautiful outdoor scene and I'm sort of getting uh, the sense of an outdoor picnic. If you are having uh, a lunch break at work, make the effort to ask a friend to go outside and join you for a little picnic. Um, don't stay at your desk for lunch. Don't sit in the office all day or wherever you work. Get outside of the building. And I'm hearing that will refresh you and recharge you to make this final push that putting in the effort that I'm talking about is gonna require you to step outside today and refresh yourself. So take little breaks if you can't take one long break. And if you do get a lunch break where you can go outside and, and walk on the grass or smell the fresh air, I'm actually smelling ocean air right now. And I feel like shivers in my body like I'm standing at the ocean. So somebody is by somewhere where they can go out by the beach go out by the beach, go out by the ocean, um, go sit in the grass, go walk in the grass. And if you can, ask somebody to join you and really make the, refresh yourself because you're gonna maybe burn the candle at both ends today with the moon and Virgo energy, but make the effort, it's really worth it. So um, having said all of that, I'd like to let you know um, I'm available for private readings and healing sessions. So if you need some help with anything, uh, you just feel free to reach out to me at racincula at gmail.com. And I will be seeing you all pretty soon. So have a great Wednesday. Happy hump day, people. I love you all. Bye-bye.